everybody, we are Mad Dog and Merrill, and we are at All Things Jerky. We certainly are. We are in Appleton, Wisconsin. They also have a great place in Monopoly and Eagle River. And we're going to have the most unique, most exotic <laughs> show you've ever seen. Freddie, are you up to Exotic? Yeah. Why? I got something exotic for you here. Ziki of bread oh. and a turkey burger. Will you cook these up for me? What? And we're at All Things Jerky, Freddie. You want turkey burgers and Ezekiel bread? Oh, jeez. Freddie, <laughs> Freddie, Freddie. Thanks Freddy. a lot, you bear. <laughs> Well, we're at the exotic meat stand, ladies and gentlemen, and we are Mad Dog and Merrill, and we'll be right back with Mad Dog and Merrill's Midwest Growing from All Things Jerky. Oh, yes. Ooh. Freddy, 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 Freddy. Mad Dog and Merrill's Midwest Grillin' is brought to you by Modern Home Products, the makers of MHP, Phoenix, and Profire Grills, All Things Jerky, Cherry Delight, Brewpub Pizza, Healthy Homegrown Wisconsin Potatoes, Lashbro Aerial Images, Sundrop Soda, the Oneida Nation, and the new Oneida Market, and by Glorious Malone's Fine Sausage. Don't worry, folks, we are normal. Welcome back to Mad Dog and Merrill's Midwest Grilling. We are at our good friends at All Things Jerky, allthingsjerky.com. Go online, find out all the great exotic gifts, unique gifts. Oh, uh, great gifts. Yeah. Birthday gifts, anniversary gifts, holiday gifts. <laughs> gifts of all. Gifts okay. of all. Bar mitzvah gifts. Speaking of gifts. Speaking gifts of, gifts. of love. Fre <laughs> Freddie, Freddie, I, I almost forgot we have your mug of meat for you. Oh, uh, there's your, 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 your weekly mug of meat, which is about 12 sticks of jerky or meat sticks of exotic flavors that you can order online. That's the number one sale online, by the way. They also have exotic meat bouquets. So you gotta go online at all things. There you go, Freddie. There's your nice little mug. Freddie, I'll have that devoured you see before what I the got show's from over. Steve? What's that? Well, look at it, it's your brother. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, brother. Just start playing that piano at the wrong time, and you'll find out how much I can snap back. <laughs> all right, what do you got going? I'll tell you what, our good friends at All Things Jerky uh, supplied us with some great, uh, it's a great place to come. It's the most unique, most exotic place you can come for gifts and great ideas, for tailgate parties, for holiday gifts, for any occasions whatsoever. We're going to be doing some unique things here today. We like certainly you are. The first on the grill, and I browned them up a little bit, on the inside they got a great little meter meat case it's a freezer case and we have some exotic meats today I chose kangaroo and we did kangaroo burgers cooked up they're browned on each side now they're really lean so they cook fast but they got a whole case of exotic meats that you can come and shop here and I took the kangaroo and we're gonna do kangaroo pouches or kangaroo pockets at the end whichever you want prefer to call them so I've got the kangaroo on the inside now one of our, our good friends is hippie Wayne Hippie Wayne's from the, the Appleton area here in the valley, and he comes out with salsas, pickled eggs, pickled oh. uh, Brussels sprouts, pickled beans, pickled asparagus, pickled mushrooms. Oh, I know, it's the mushrooms, man. I was hoping he'd say mushrooms. I love his mushrooms. So, all sealed up to perfection. We have a little bit of his salsa. So we're gonna do some nice little salsa the border pockets. So I've got these browned up. So to get going on these, we're gonna top them with a little bit of that wonderful corn and bean salsa. And that's some good thick stuff, Wayne. You're a good man. He hey, is. by the way, wish Hippie Wayne a, a happy birthday. He just turned 65. Did he really? He has a birthday every year. <laughs> wow, that must be nice. I never get that. So on the inside also of all things jerky, they've got some wonderful curds, cheese curds. So this is all things jerky's jalapeno cheese curds. Ooh. So it's the jalapeno ones. So I'm going to peel off some of those, and that's going to be our little bit of a cheese on top. And Merrill, what do you got cooking? Hey, you know what I'm going to do? No, hey, Jack. Hey, Jack. What? Lope. Jackalope. Jackalope hey. sausage is right here. Do you know Jack? <laughs> I know Jack. Jackalope sausage is right here. You got it. We're talking about rabbit, and we're talking about antelope, all mixed together here. Jackalope. Very nice and lean. Doesn't take very long to cook. I'm going to throw these right on the grill. And there again, we're talking something different, really something way out of the ordinary of doing it on the grill. So I'm going to place these on the grill, That's cook them direct, like nice low heat. You don't want it real high or anything. A nice low heat and brown them up, be really good. They're, they're really nice and lean. They are good and lean. All you really do is really want to warm up, like I said. So jackalope. Now we're cooking on the Phoenix Grill over here. So Merrill's got that turned on to a nice low heat. Our good friends at Phoenix Grills 
Over here I got the MHP grill cooking away. So I've got one side kind of fired up on a higher heat because we're going to do some cedar planking in a minute or two. And we got almost turned off over here are those uh, kangaroo burgers with the pockets going to be ready to be done. We have the salsa and the cheese over there. So we're going to get those done a little bit. I'm going to move some things aside right here. Safety first, I got a cooler down below. Good man. Now on the inside, this is great. I got to get my glasses on because I'm going to open up a cup. We love doing summer sausage on the grill. Now just normal summer sausage, that's kind of boring at all things jerky. It is. So we need exotic roadkill sausages. So our, our Fender Bender roadkill summer sausages today, uh, it's actually a combination of wild boar, bison, uh, looks like antelope, looks like alligator, looks like wow. rabbit, and, 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 and elk. So that's a nice little combination. Bender, bender, that'd be something Freddie would be into. And he's always on a bender. <laughs> he is always on a bender. I almost hit a turtle on the way here. We could add <laughs> So that's right. You two are, are you two grandpas? Freddie, are you a grandpa? <laughs> yeah, of course I am. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know that. <laughs> so we're gonna, this is also, this is a spicy elk, a spicy elk summer sausage. So all we're simply going to do is toss these on a grill on a nice lower heat. We're going to strip all the wrappers off here, and I guess I do have a wrapper on this exotic one over here too. We're going to strip the wrappers off our summer sausage, and you've seen us slice them in half. You've seen us carve a little wedge out of them and stuff them. These are going to go directly on the grates of the grill, just like a big old frankfurter. And I'm going to save a little bit of room over here, and we're going to put these right aside. We're going to put them right over the side of our, uh, by our kangaroo, where the cheese is melting really nice. I like it. I like it. Oh, we forgot our one of these, Merrill. Oh, they're your chirps. Chirps. Oh, chirps. Yeah. Chips. No, chirps. Chirps. They say chirps. They say chirps. They're five grams of protein. They're actually cricket chips. Yeah. Oh. So we got the cheddar cricket chips. And what we're going to do with those is pop a bag open from wow, the bottom. Did you see I'll how strong he was? From the bottom. was? unbelievable. Wow. And He's been what we're going to do is those are going to ladle on top of our little kangaroo burger. So there. we can't forget about those. No, I like those. Those are good. Now, nice when we, when we toured field, the inside field. of all things jerky, when we toured the inside of all things jerky, we had a lot of a lot of chances to do different cuts of meat. And and and, and when I got here, I said, Merrill, I says, you got to do quail. I know. I love I, quail. I love quail. I do. I've done it before. It's absolutely great to do on the grill. Does not take that long to do quail on the grill. So let, let me, let me talk grab about the, let me yeah, grab the quail. 15. Yeah, give me the quail, sir. It's going to be right in the package. So now the quail, we bought frozen, we thawed it out. It's actually semi-boneless quail. There's 14 ounces to every package. And I'm going to give you that, Merrill. You can use this knife here and then, oh, you got a knife I got there? a knife right here, sir. Done, I got so many knives. When we're done with that knife, we're going to move it off to yep. the side. Move it off or to the side. Move it over. Yep. Move it over. Let me get my chirps out okay. of the way. So the quail is going to cook up relatively fast. Does not take long at all. Yeah. It really does not. Whoops. Get that out of the way. Yeah, I got Wasn't some garbage right. there, right. man. Quail does not take that long at all. The big thing that you want to do is make sure when you're doing the quail, that you want to make sure that you've got an oil base on that just a little bit, because we're going to season it really well. But as you can see, the quail isn't that big, but boy, it is very, very, very tasty. Very flavorful. Those are absolutely delicious little quail. Those oh, they are. are. Oh, they are. Yeah, I those love are them. delicious looking. That's one of my favorite things that I get here at the store here. Okay, just a little bit of oil. And I'm going to oil that just a little bit on both sides of the sunflower oil. When you're doing any type of, even for poultry or anything, you want to oil it first so at least brown those up a little bit. And then I'm just seasoning this with obviously our seasoning, but we're going to be using a little bit of Grillin' Magic, which is a garlic pepper blend. And what I like about Grillin' Magic, you can pour the ever-living daylights out of it. That's I mean, exactly you can really right. coat it really, really good. So I'm going to do both sides on that with a little bit of our seasonal, which we're going to add a little bit more sodium. By on the there. way, when you come to All Things Jerky, or if you order online, you can get our products through them. They do sell all of our products on the store, in the in-store on the inside there. So make sure you do that. So I'm going to coat these both on each side. Now here's what we're going to do, and I'm going to help you out here, right. Mr. Morrell. We're going to grab. We sliced up some onions. We sliced up some green peppers, and we have some broadhead parsley. And on the grill, Merrill threw one of our grill mats on the grill. So that's heated up really nice. I'm going to turn your jackalope sausages. Thank you, sir. And I'm going to turn that burner off underneath the jackalope sausage. Those got to sit for a little bit there. OK. So we're going to add a little bit of onion slices. OK. We'll add those peppers. You did a nice job of slicing. Thank you, man. Oil. They call me the slicer dicer, man. Yeah, I guess so. Then we're going to add some nice little, we add some broadhead parsley. Broadhead parsley. Flat broadhead parsley, Italian parsley, whatever you want to call it. 
And you got a little lemon and lime? Well, I have lemon and lime, sir, lemon on lime. both of them. You better believe it. I'll help you squeeze Coat a that bit really there. good. Wow. You're good. You gotta be good. You gotta be good. A little bit of oil. Need a little green, Fred. You need a little I always need a little green. A little green there. And my wallet is where I need a and little green. And then all things at. jerky is all about the jerky. So we have a little I bit like of their chew jerky. So that's already diced up. You can dice their own. But we're gonna add a little uh, bit of chew jerky over the top of that. Mix chew, that chew. up. <laughs> and then Merrill's gonna get that on the grill, but here's what he's gonna do. Now we gotta get going. We gotta get some python on the grill. We got, right. we got a lot all of right. things to do in this first segment so we can get a lot of things done. Are you ready? I we'll thought. get to you geese next, you dang fool. <laughs> Pretty soon you'll be inside the old jig circuit. You better believe it. <laughs> so here we go. Here's what we did, ladies and gentlemen. Also on the inside, they have some wonderful python. Now the python meat what do you think it tastes like, Freddie? Oh, you know what? It, it's going to taste like chicken. Just about everything you make tastes like <laughs> Don't chicken. Don't you have a rubber chicken <laughs> Except there? for chicken. Here he <laughs> is. Someone <laughs> has a rubber chicken. Oh, <laughs> Freddie, Freddie, Freddie. Python, Freddy. it tastes like chicken. Freddie, Freddie. <laughs> We're going to slice open the python. We're going to grab that baby out of the bag. We're going to plop that in the countertop. I'm going to set this down below. And we're simply going to oil this baby up also. And you know what? I got a name for that. I'm going to call him Monty. Yeah, there you go. There it is. <laughs> ah, Monty Python. I like it. I like it. Then we're going to add a little bit of Grandma Hazel over the top. Here's what we're doing, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to cedar plank our python. So in the cedar planks, I, pipe, I, pop, I plopped in the water some nice little uh, cedar planks. These are untreated cedar planks. They're all soaked to the dickens. We're going to take our python. Those can be done directly on the grates of the grill, but I'm actually going to put them on a plank and cedar plank those babies and set them right over there. And by the time we come back in a few minutes or so, we should have some great cedar plank python from All Things Jerky. Go to allthingsjerky.com. Yes. Appleton, Wisconsin, Manaqua, and also Eagle River. Great, unique gifts of exoticness. Oh, yes. Hey folks, Mad Dog and Merrill, nothing better than a pile of wings and Mad Dog and Merrill's grilling sauces. You got that right, Mad Dog. I'm ready to dig into these babies. <laughs> Number one, thick and rich. I'm going for the spicy. And it's the smokehouse for me, yeah. Oh, this time I'm going for the spicy. Oh man, I got the hickory. <laughs> uh... Ask your grocer for Mad Dog and Merrill. Brew Pub Pizza is specifically designed with the hungry in mind. It's big, it's bold, and it's outrageously delicious. Brew Pub Lots of Matza Pizza is made with your favorite premium meats and veggies topped with over a half pound of real Wisconsin mozzarella cheese. When you're looking for the ultimate pizza adventure, when you crave a really serious pizza that brings the great Brew Pub experience, this is the one. Pick it up today at your favorite local grocer. Brew Pub Lots of Matza Pizza, the ingredients for a great time. Lashbro Aerial Images, a division of Lashbro Visual Communications, is a premier drone imaging company. Stunning high definition video, compelling high resolution photography. Lashbro Aerial Images is remote pilot certified and fully insured. Images for advertising, broadcast, print, online, mapping, real estate, and more. Take your vision to the next level with Lashbro Aerial Images. Hey buddy, what, wear the throwback uniform. Well boys, you see, it's to celebrate the glory days, the pride, the passion, the tradition. Wow, what could be better than wearing a throwback uniform on game day? How about throwing back a green and gold citrusy sun drop soda in a throwback bottle while wearing my throwback uniform on game day? The pride, the passion, the tradition. Throwback a green and gold sun drop today. Wisconsin farmers support an 80 plus billion dollar industry that employs more than 400,000 people. Farmers continue to sustain Mother Nature's resources for future generations and create quality relationships with area businesses. Mark Toyota thanks the farmer. Jamar thanks the farmer. Ansane Associates thanks the farmer. Central Door Solutions thanks the farmer. Mid State Truck Service thanks the farmer. And we thank you for buying Wisconsin potatoes. Mad Dog had a chance to take a tour of All Things Jerky, so let's go ahead and take a look. Hey, here we are at All Things Jerky. 
Appleton, Wisconsin. Don't forget their Manaqua and Eagle River location. Let's head inside and see all the goodies they got. All right, my dad's birthday's coming up. I'm gonna get him a mug of meat, and we are at the wall of, of jerkies and sticks, but not just normal ones. I'm talking, we've got wild boar, we've got ostrich, and you can create your own mug of meat. What have we got next? Oh, a little bit of bison, little buffalo over here. We've got the alligator, and don't forget you can go on allthingsjerky.com, and you can order and ship anywhere in the United States a mug of meat to your favorite friend. You know what, all my life I've collected hot sauces, and it used to start out with jalapenos and maybe habaneros, but now there's ghost peppers, Carolina Reapers, scorpion peppers, and all things jerky got great things like liquid stupid, you can't beat that. Here's a little butt twister over here. Boy, I'll tell you what, here's the colon cleaner here. Here's whoop bacon. Boy, we're gonna have fun bleeping this one out, aren't we folks? All right, here's one of my best parts of all things jerky is you get to build your own bag of different beef jerkies. And let me tell you folks, if you think you got a he-man, a macho man in the family, give him a bag of this stuff right here. We got a little Carolina Reaper. We got a little ghost pepper beef jerky. Here's death by jerky. I mean, you can't go wrong with that. I'll tell you what, you think you got a macho man in the family. Here's habanero, but here's my style down here. This is the ones I'm going for. These are my favorite down here. I got a sweet and spicy, I got a hot Jamaican. These are flavorful, great beef jerkies. Pepper jerky, black pepper over here. That's my favorite. On the other side, a great variety. So you can actually dig right in, get a little bit of a, a sweet, and spicy, and that's not too bad. Now you can buy your own jerky, you can buy your own sausages, but this is a great thing about the store here, is that here, this all wall right here is all things to do with creating your own home projects, like making your own sausages. Here's the nice casings you can do. Here's the spices for all your different sausages that you may want to do. Here's a habanero one, here's a Bloody Mary one. Here's a great little uh, Sheboygan bratwurst style one if you want to, German bologna over here. Now we get to the jerky part where you want to make your own jerkies at home. These are all the jerky kits and all the seasonings. Little smoke flavor if you want to. Cherry is good, apple is good if you want to do the little smoking for your jerkies. Here's all the different seasonings. Now we get into the project making stuff. We've got the, uh, the, 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 the everything you need to do to make jerkies right here on this whole wall. So stop into All Things Jerky or go online at allthingsjerky.com. Order kits for yourself. See what they've got. Come on into the stores. Appleton, Manaqua, Eagle River. So now we're over here at the wall of novelties and you can get yourself a little alligator back scratcher. Nothing wrong with that. Get the old back scratcher there. Uh, these are bobbers for fishing. It's made out of shotgun shells. Here you go. Here's a little bit of rut wipe. TP. <laughs> now over here, these are my favorites. These are great. These are great for the kids. We got all kinds of great little crickets and bugs that are all edible, all dried and edible. You can come and buy little packs of those. I make desserts with them on the grill. They're absolutely wonderful. We got little candies. We got little popsicles with bugs right in them. Can't beat that, can ya? all things jerky, they have so many exotic different types of meats raw that you cook at home. I mean, look at this. We've got venison, we've got rabbit, we've got camel, we've got ostrich. We have over here kangaroo patties, bison patties, elk patties, ribeye steaks of bison, elk stews meat. I mean, all kinds of great things and sausages all right here. You got to come into the store and we got rattlesnake over here. We got jackalope sausages over here, elk sausages, python, kangaroo, venison, bison pot stickers. I mean, what more does a man and a woman need at your grilling? This is it, folks. All things jerky. Are you tired of the same old thing? Moo. Taste the wild side with exotic edibles from All Things Jerky. Check out our large selection of exotic jerky and frozen meats. Gator, kangaroo, boar, bison, elk, and more. Try before you buy with our bulk beef jerky. We carry hot sauces and supplies to make your own jerky and sausage. The perfect gift for every occasion is our mug of meat and gift boxes. Visit our stores in Eagle River, Manaqua, and Appleton, and shop online at allthingsjerky.com. More than just jerky, All Things Jerky. You've come a long ways, Joe. A two-time Olympian, a World Cup captain, and an NHL All-Star. How'd you get so good, Joe? Hard work and nutrition from Wisconsin Potatoes. Wisconsin Potatoes. Grandpa, please pass the potatoes. I got this. 
What? Healthy and delicious Wisconsin potatoes. Ah, Wisconsin winter sports and a crisp old-fashioned sun drop soda. Ah, yeah, perfect for snowmobiling, skiing, sledding, hockey. Or you know what, Mad Dog, just relaxing on the old eye. You know, Merrill, there may be a legal limit on walleye, perch, or, or bottle bass. But there's no limit on good old-fashioned sun drop soda. Wisconsin winter sports. Be safe, drink responsible, drink locally bottled sun drop soda. All right, guys, off the ice. Puck drops in five minutes. Mad Dog and Merrill here. Try our to work. I love sun-ripe tomatoes on my burger. Sun-ripe tomato, it's all in there. Man, I love sauerkraut on my sausages. <laughs> sauerkraut, it's in there. <laughs> uh, I love spicy mustard on everything. Spicy mustard, it's in there. It's so sad, I love onions. <laughs> Onions, it's in there. DeWorks, no more mess. All in one condiment, and now DeWorks with sweet pickle relish. Ask your grocer for Mad Dog and Merrill. Inflammation and muscle pain can prevent us from activities such as walking, golfing, exercising, and more. Rapid Performance Products provides all natural relief utilizing the superfruit tart cherries. Rapid Red contains natural antioxidants that help combat the inflammation and pain of our muscles associated with activity. To help the aging maintain their muscle mass, try our Rapid Whey with 12 grams of whey protein isolate. Keep fit and stay active with Rapid Performance Products. That's all we get from your friend? Oh, Freddy. Freddy. We've been robbed. Freddy. We've been robbed. <laughs> That's enough. That's enough of Freddy. <laughs> hey, our good friends, Steve and Jessica. It's with Steve and Jessica Jerky, by the way. That's not their last name, but they're going to change it to Jerky because it's all things jerky. And when you come to the Appleton store, you always get a smile from Paula. Yes, you do. She's usually here some of the days. And there's Steve and Jessica. Then you go up to Minocqua, Wisconsin, and also Eagle River. And there's two great stores up there, allthingsjerky.com. And you can go to any one of those stores or online, and you can help out Snacks for the Soldiers snacks for the soldiers and they send over nice gift boxes during the holiday season very nice so go online and find out how you can help them out with that and also you can come to the appleton store and you got a new great big the vinegator <laughs> the <laughs> vinegator and you can have your picture taken with the vinegator i know you gotta and, do it you it's gotta a do little it crocodile type style little artwork thing that you can have your picture taken with so you got to do that so it's a great place let's do some unveiling all right Mary. sir hey, hey. i'm gonna help you scoop a little bit here okay Ooh, oh, looks good, sir. Uh, that looks good. There is Merrill's gorgeous quail. Oh, the aroma. Beautiful, isn't it? The aroma. There's the gorgeous quail with the peppers and the onions and everything oh, else. Oh, man, that beautiful. It's just absolutely wonderful. Over here, we have our plank planked python. And I'd rather than take the board off, I'm going to grab our tongs. Now, the python's cooking down just wonderful. I found out through Steve that the python, when you come and get it, here's what you do with it. If you ever had little deep fried catfish nuggets, that's what you want to do. You want to cut up the python in little chunks, bread them up, and deep fry them. And they're made, made for great little nuggets. And that's a wonderful way to do those, is the python to do those. The kangaroo pockets turned out really, really well. And what we're going to do with those, and we really don't have time today because we had a lot of fun here and a lot of great time. You can take the kangaroo pockets, the pouches, take some tortilla shells, and you want to slap a little bit of uh, sour cream right there and fold them into Whoa. a little pocket or a pouch, and you got kangaroo pouches. So uh -huh. that's a great way to do those. Every kangaroo has a pouch. Here's our exotic sausages, our roadkill oh, sausages. Now we're going to slice into those babies, and we got the crew behind us that's been watching us. So we're going to slice into those sausages. We're going to slob them with a little bit of Mad Dog and Merrill's barbecue sauce. Oh, the aroma is great can, on those. Isn't it wonderful? Boy, those sure look good. And now we're going to hop over and get our jackalope sausages. Merrill's jackalope sausages. And it's we'll hot. just place those right there. Now the jackalope sausages, and they have all kinds of great exotic meats. They got alligator, they got rabbit, they got wild boar. If you want something more unique, come and get a little bit of wild boar sausages, and you got yourself a meal and a half. Well, Fred, something. you've had wild boar before, <laughs> yes, haven't you? I from did. from yep. all things jerky, it was great. It was really something. More yes. unique flavor like you wouldn't believe. Well, it's so, great of all the, all the different flavors and everything. It is. So for all your great holiday gifts, for great ideas, for those exotic, unique days that you want to really splurge a little bit, go to All Things Jerky. Pick up some nice mug of meats, mm. the nice, beautiful mug of meats, the exotic meat bouquets, allthingsjerky.com. What a great thing. We'll be right back in just a moment or two to wrap this baby up. We're going to sample out to all our crew that's been watching us, and we do appreciate you, good folks. <laughs> Thank you. 
As a mother, I choose healthy snacks for my children. What they eat now can have a lasting effect on their overall health. Cherry Delight dried cherries provide a healthy snack and taste delicious. Unlike sugary treats, these tasty fruit snacks are all natural and provide essential nutrients and vitamins important in growing bodies. From chocolate covered Cherry Delights to tart cherry juice, these snacks are full of nutrition. Visit us in Forceville, just 30 minutes from Green Bay, or order online at countryovens.com. Glorious Malone's Gourmet Head Cheese and Country Pâtés are Southern deliciousness. Tender pork, blended spices, and bold flavors. Superbly handcrafted fresh, without fillers, jellies, or preservatives. Glorious Malone's quality flavors have been loved throughout the Midwest for over 60 years. Enjoy it sliced on crackers, or think outside the cracker. Try it on pizza, burgers, stuffed pork, and more. Ask your grocer for Malone's. Mmm, Southern deliciousness. Hocus Pocus Grillorama. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you grilling magic. Grilling magic, a perfect blend of garlic and pepper and other magical ingredients. I'm Grandma Hazel. Try my secret family spice blend, passed down from generations. Steaks, fish, burgers, chicken pork, all things grilled. Grandma Hazel never rubbed you wrong. <laughs> the best in the Midwest, Grilling Magic, Grandma Hazel, and our own seasonal. Ask your grocer for Mad Dog and Merrill. I came in initially for um, lower neck pain and back pain, headaches. Whiplash. Migraine headaches. I have never used chiropractic here before. I was very nervous. I decided to choose a back in action. Something amazing happened. Dr. Hansen has actually made some other improvements that I was not seeing him for. It wasn't actually back issues, but it was a nutritional issue. Dr. Hansen, he goes above and beyond. They're very thorough. I would highly recommend using back in action with Dr. Hansen. And relief is, is sooner than you think. Now, Merrill, you sink this putt, you win the tournament, and the coveted cooler of ice-cold sundrop soda. Towel. Sundrop. Pull the pin. Locally bottled, crisp, old-fashioned flavor, sundrop. Make your summer fantasy come true. What's your summer sundrop fantasy? It has been reported that Mad Dog and Merrill's signature sauces and spices have been seen around the world. And now we want to know where in the world is Mad Dog and Merrill? Take a selfie holding a Mad Dog and Merrill's product in front of a sign or interesting landmark. Post the photo to Mad Dog and Merrill's Facebook page. And once a month, one lucky fan will win a grilling set of Mad Dog and Merrill's products. Go to Facebook.com slash Mad Dog and Merrill. Happy grilling! Well, welcome back to Mad Dog and Merrill's Midwest Grilling. We had a great time at all things jerky, didn't we, folks? Yeah, all right, good and deal. And the python did taste like chicken. <laughs> <laughs> Allthingsjerky.com, ladies and gentlemen. Mad Dog and Merrill's Midwest Grilling, thanks a lot. Mad Dog and Merrill's Midwest Grilling is a production of Lash Pro Visual Communications.